All right, good day. It's Mrs. Spiracino here, here to teach you how to play the multiplication game. All right, pretty simple game, but I want to explain to you so you know how to play it. So up here you see this grid of numbers, and down below is numbers 1 through 9. You're going to need a partner for this. You cannot play with more than two people. And you're going to need a pencil because you need to be able to erase. All right, so player 1 circles a number. I'm going to circle 3. Let's say I have a partner, player 2... I'm going to use him in green. Player two circles five, okay? Player one gets the product of those two numbers. So multiply them together, five times three, and I get 15, and I'm going to be an X. Green is going to be the O's, all right? Now, player two's turn. Player two can move one of these numbers, and he's going to move mine, and he's going to circle the four. Now he's got five times four. 5 times 4 is 20. He's an O. He goes there. Now, the object of the game is to get 4 in a row. So this green, putting that O there, that was a very smart move because it blocked me from going 4 that way. All right. I am going to take my turn, and I'm going to erase my 4, and I'm going to put a 5 on top of a 5. 5 times 5 is 25. All right. Now, 20's got to figure out how to block me here. I've got a 5, and I can only move 1, so it's going to be difficult for me to block because um, these do not, are not multiples of 5. So, since I can only move 1, 5, I have to keep 1, 5. I can only move 1 circle. I'm going to do 5 times 6 because at least then I'm starting to make my own 4 in a row, and then I'm going to try and block them on the next one. All right, player one gets it back, and player one does six times six. Six times six is 36. One more, and he wins a game. Now I better figure something out here. Um, six times, boy, that's going to be a hard one. Well, six times nine is what? 54. So... He's going to move one of these. He's got to leave one, but he can move the other one to nine. And six times nine is 54. So my circle goes there, and he's blocked. Now it is Red's turn again. Um, let's see. Well, I need that seven and a one. And I can't do that right now. So I'm going to have to do, let's see. Wow, this is going to be a hard one. How about nine times, well, nine times three would give me 27, but I can't do four across, so it's kind of a waste. How about, well, um, let's do six times, let's do six times seven anyway. Six times seven will give me, oh, I did it in green, sorry. Six times seven will be 42. See, now i got to fill in the 40 and 45 to get four crossed. So the point of the game is each time it's your turn, you can move one circle, and you get the product of that circle. First person of four in a row wins a game. All right? Any questions? Let me know. You have a great day. Make great choices, and I will see you soon.